Now the latest in our series, Streamlined, where we bring you some of the biggest films and TV series hitting digital screens worldwide, speaking with some of the actors and creators behind them. The 1992 classic film, White Men Can't Jump, surpassed expectations upon its release, cleverly weaving elements of culture into the storyline. This magic is now being rebooted to reflect the societal landscape of today through a highly anticipated remake starring actor Cinqua Walls and rapper Jack Harlow. Let's take a look. Ball. I just noticed you're not getting enough legs on a new shot. Are you dehydrated? 100 bucks, you can't make more shots. Let's just do 300. It's not my dad's money. You ain't never gonna get a reparation that way, bro. So I prefer Venmo or Zelle, but you seem like a Cash App guy, so. Ladies and gentlemen, every Hooper I know is entering that big ass tournament with a winner get 500,000. I just need somebody who can play so I can make some money. You're joking, right? Actor Cinqua Walls is here. Now, I'm looking forward to seeing this. I'm glad, I'm glad. Thank you. Right, this is one of the biggest sports remakes to come out in a yes. while. What yes. was the pressure like knowing how loved this was from the beginning? You know what's interesting? I grew up a kid, um, a fan of the film, and watching it so many times. So it wasn't necessarily a pressure, but more for me, like a responsibility. And I felt like, you know, I was the guy for the job to step in. I grew up a Wesley Snipes fan. I grew up a Woody Harrelson fan. So I understood the magnitude of that Going into this, we needed to do everything we could to make sure we honored them and then updated the story. So it wasn't as much pressure as more as a responsibility to make mm. sure I made them proud and they could walk away going, OK, you did everything you could and left it on the on the court. Left it all out left there. Left it all on the court. And of course, you play Kamal, Wesley Snipes Correct. character. Yes. How did you draw inspiration from that, but at the same time make this your own? You know, I mean, to be honest, Kamal and, and, and Wesley's character, Sydney, are so different in who they are as men and the iteration of who they become in this new and updated story. So a lot of it was just making sure that there was like a ground itself. The biggest thing that I noticed for the two is that they have a lot of confidence. And Wesley entered into the story with a lot of confidence. He kept that confidence and it grew. Uh, Kamal, when he walked into the story, he's lacking a lot of confidence. And he's not the person that we see him become over the course of the, st of the story. So I had to, you know, um, I guess, remove some of his confidence from the beginning mm. and then return it back in the end. Oh, of course, when we're looking at the 1992 version, yeah. part of that, it's not so much about basketball as it is about race in a lot of dimensions, really, right, when you think right, about it. Right. How were you guys able to take that and really modernize it, still have that cultural relevance for Absolutely. now? Absolutely. I think... And like you said, I think the biggest thing for 92 was that it always was indicative of culture. And I think that's what any great movie has. I think that's what great stories have, are making sure they weave a lot of culture into the background of any story or filmatic story that they're telling. And for us, mental health is so important now. I think people are on a, on a journey of expansion and learning what they can do internally to help themselves and the people around them. And tell us about that why that is so important, especially for men, yeah. to be able to see and talk yeah. about mental health and that journey that really unites the two characters. You know, I think mental health, I'm a huge advocate for it. I believe in it myself. Um, I always try to talk about it consistently. I think for men specifically, black men specifically, it's important to make sure that you know what you're going through so that you can help yourself, help people around you, and you can kind of like demystify the ability that you have to have it all figured out that you have to be strong in every circumstance because all of us are sometimes fashioning strength when a lot of times we're fractured and we need to have a community and a village for people around us to help us. So many layers to this yeah. movie yeah. Uh, that's really significant. And you and Jack have a really great chemistry. Yeah. You and I were talking earlier about how this was his first movie. Normally people know him as a rapper. As a rapper, Jack Harlow, yeah. What did you guys do in order to, to really build on that? You know, I always say this. I think Jack and I both come from a similar space and time we came through a, we come from a similar agreement in life which is to just let each other be themselves mm. i never tried to force myself on jack jack never tried to force himself on me and we understood the responsibility the magnitude of it and we were just like all right so at the end of the day all we have is each other yeah and if we're gonna get you know off this island or if we're gonna make it back to shore we have to lean on each other, but it, it started with us just not judging each other and just letting each other be themselves. Of course, you, as we discussed, uh, played college basketball. You know, you're a ball player. Yeah. How about Jack? Can he jump? Listen, listen, I say, I've said this. You know, it's called White Man Can't Jump. For that white man can't jump. <laughs> he cannot? <laughs> he can actually jump. No, oh, that white can. man can he jump. He can. I, I was surprised. Jack is very athletic. He did all of his own stunts. Um, he dunked it every single time. There was oh. a time when Jack had to do it about 13 times. 
And he got up and got that dunk every time. And one time he actually stared me down and I was like, are you in character? You're just trying to let me know. <laughs> <laughs> Cinqua, so looking forward to this. Thank you for Thank joining you. us tonight. Really appreciate that. Want to let all of our viewers know white men can't jump, except for Jack, who can. <laughs> It'll be streaming May 19th on Hulu. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.